My full name is Stephen Clifford Beardsell. I am a international glass artist. I'm known around the world. I've taught in America. I've consulted in China. My work is in America, China, South Africa. I've had some horrific burns, some horrific cuts, some minor burns and some minor cuts. <laughs> the creative element is something that really does feed me kind of like a religion, but not. I'll never retire. A long time ago, I dreamt of like making sculpture from the planet's energy, lightning, into creating new forms of sculpture. A fulgurite is where the lightning has naturally struck some sand somewhere on the planet, creating a sculptural form of its own. All I'm going to do is take that energy and create a more controlled form with it. My first form is going to be a DNA strand and then we're going to expand that and create more elaborate forms running up to a full-size human figure. It's thought that lightning could have been the spark that gave this planet life. What Project Lightning Glass is, is we're going to go out to the Mexican desert, New Mexico, where we're guaranteed lightning storms July, August, September. We're going to construct two towers. The tower consists of a clam kiln, a strike chamber, which will contain the sculpture and the sand, a strike rod, which will be struck by the rocket lightning. The rocket goes up 300 meters, and we pretty much guaranteed a lightning strike, and that will allow the electricity to pass through the sand, melting the sand into sculpture. I've minimalized in the whole idea of being struck by lightning. The whole camp is going to have a Faraday cage. The camp itself is a complete safe zone because we don't know when lightning is going to strike. It's going to be tricky, but I've done my homework, my science, my research. So yeah, I think this is a very big possibility. In fact, I would put my life on it. <laughs> this is actually a world first attempt at this and we will make it happen.